Penny Lancaster. Welcome, Penny. Thank you very much. I'm privileged and honoured to have been invited today, so I'm very, very excited about what I've seen so far. Would you mind if we asked you a few questions? Go ahead. What inspired you to be a model? Oh, um, well, when I was at school, I wasn't sure what career um, I wanted to go into, and everybody said, well, because you're so tall, maybe modelling would be a good thing. So I ended up going to the London College of Fashion and did a year's course there for modelling, which taught me about the modelling industry and fashion industry, and um, that's how I eventually got into, into the modelling game. Did you oh. enjoy it? I did love it. And I, I was always very much interested in the photography aspect, what was going on behind the camera, whereas I was always in front of the camera. So I, I then went on to Barking College and did a two-year photography diploma. And that's how I got into photography. How long have you been dancing? Um, I started dancing when I was about six or seven. And I danced for, for about five years until I realised I was going to be too tall to be a dancer. So being tall is an advantage when you want to be a model, but not when you want to be a dancer. Um, but I've always loved dancing, and, and that's, uh, that was a great joy when I got to um, be in this series of Strictly Come Dancing, which I'm sure you're all very familiar with. Why, why are you interested in children having a good breakfast? Oh, well, I've got two children, two boys, a nine and three-year-old, and I'm always worried as a mother about making sure that they've got enough nutrition in them and they're going to be full tummies and ready to, to engage and, and work at school. So I make sure that my two have a very healthy breakfast in the morning, not ch chocolate spreads and frosted coated. So I make sure they have a healthy breakfast, um, oatmeal, um, eggs, so I know they go off to school already and prepare for the day. So uh, that was why I was very interested in, in, the, in, the, in the project in Penning for London and encouraging these kind of um, areas where they have children come into school and, and have a good breakfast before they start the day. It's wonderful. What were your dreams as a kid? dreams as a kid. I always liked the idea of travelling. I wanted to see what else was out there in the world and um, I've seen quite a bit of it. <laughs> we do a lot of travelling. We live most of the time in Los Angeles um, and we have a house back here in England and my husband sings as you know and so he tours all around the world so we travel with him as a family. We're off to Australia in a few months time. So uh, yes, yeah, so one of my dreams of travelling did come true. Well, did you have a good breakfast when you were young? I do remember having a good breakfast. I always had a very healthy appetite. Um, and then my, I remember the lunch that my mum used to pack me, I used to have as a snack and then went to school dinner. So um, maybe that's why I was so tall, because I ate lots of healthy breakfast. <laughs> How did a good breakfast benefit you? Well, I think if you, if you go to school hungry, then you're going to be distracted, you won't have energy, and so I think by having a healthy breakfast for the start of the day um, just makes you more productive. Did you enjoy school? I did, I loved school, I really did enjoy school. Um, all the different aspects from classroom to out on the, on the, uh, on the grass doing PE, um, after school activities weren't what they are today, you, you kids have got a lot more choice. Um, but. Uh, I did a lot of swimming, oh. uh, swam for the school, so that was fun. How did you feel when you were dancing? Um, you, you mean on the show, on Strictly Come Dancing, I was extremely nervous because it was a live TV show and you knew that there were millions of viewers watching you and if you make a mistake, you can't redo it. So I had to keep telling myself, just go out there and have fun, which I did. And uh, I got halfway before I got voted out. <laughs> did, did you enjoy being a model? I did enjoy being a model. I got the chance to, once again, to, to travel. I went to different countries in Europe. Um, but my ambition was to follow that on and be, be a photographer. So some, some jobs you go into give you other opportunities to, to expand and try new things. It's always important to try, even if you don't feel you're up to the job. It's, it's worth giving it a go. Thank you, Penny. 